What's going on, everyone? Darkwater here, and welcome back to Hotel Renovator. Uh, take a, took a quick look, and looking at the bookings, cleanliness, I went through all the rooms, did some cleaning up. You are making a bunch of money. We can get more money out of room 101 and 107 by improving the star rating. Um... So that might be down the road. Room 103 obviously has got the two stars because it does have the scary bathroom in it. Can't get any more skills right now. Apparently people just love this wallpaper. That's what it is. So we need to renovate 102, 104, and 106. I think it's time to hammer. Okay, so we've destroyed all three rooms, almost. Apparently there's still some odds and ends that I need to take a whack into. Uh, let's just do a little cleaning real quick. Ooh, is that an egg? That's an egg. 5,000. Ooh. Yeah, money is a bit tight. I'm slightly a little concerned. Maybe I've been going overboard on how nice everything should be. Okay, add neon decorations. That's fine. Let's Run down the hall. We'll clean the other two rooms real quick. Okay. Oh, nope. Art Deco Shades of Mauve Pink. Okay. Let's tackle the flooring real quick. Maybe we just do carpet in this one. Maybe kids' carpet. Maybe Uncle Joe would like some uh, fun carpet time. Do we do a basic carpet? Okay, I think we're going to go with this. I'm tempted to do the entry area with hardwood. Just kind of change things up a little bit. I mean, we could just do grass. Oh, we could do a ceramic tile in the entryway. Something that's horrifically busy? No. No, let's stick with wood. I think we'll go with that. Again. There we go. Bathroom. We will go with tile just because it is going to be durable. I'd like to do this on the, the wall, quite frankly. Art Deco. Is there any Art Deco? Patterns, not really. I mean, that kind of goes with 
carpet. Uh, that's even. Okay. So it is more in the the pink shades, which we're we're good with. Walls. I want some ceramic tile on this wall because the tub's going there. Um. That's interesting. Ooh, that is way too much. That that's too much. That ah, that is what we're going with. Um, I want two squares. Oh. Oh, that, and that, there. Oop. As for the rest of the bathroom, white, hmm. I'm honestly leaning towards like a white paint. Mouse trap. Mouse gray. I don't know where I got trap from. See, I feel the pink hues in here are a little too much. Let's just go with a basic gray. Shoot, not me to paint that wall. Uh, can I get that wall back with the ceramics? Yeah. What am I looking for? Ceramic. <laughs> Okay. Quick little vacuum. Boop. Is there anything else that I just absolutely missed? Yeah. I'm there. Bottle. Everything else seems to be okay. Except for weird wall texture there. That's fine. We've got that done. Let's go to patterns and we want the art deco. Yeah. 
and shades of pink. Go with that. So that'll match with the Art Deco furniture we're going to add in here. The rest, I'm feeling. 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 I'm I'm to just roll this throughout the space, quite frankly. We need the Art Deco furniture in shades of pink as well. Give me some drapery. Are you already pink? You are. I used you in the other room. Okay. So that takes care of the curtains. Um, I did not get all the wall. Oh, I didn't get the ceiling. I'm missing wall somewhere. Oh, I'm missing the whole front entry entryway. Okay. You guys are painting that. Vacuum that up real quick. So we're going to do a big bed in here. Do we want to do too small? That does not seem like a two-star bed. I think we're gonna do two beds in here. Oh, actually, hold on. Need the Art Deco pattern. Is there not an Art Deco pattern? Yeah, it's here. You. No. That's not bad. Oh, that's, that's what I'm looking for. Get ourselves kind of some night table. Now let's go with the, the two star ones. That'll take care of those. We're going to need table chairs. How are we doing this? Tables, chairs by the window. We'll do the couch over here.
an art deco pattern on this as well. I would assume there is. But I'm not seeing one. Interesting. Where's, yeah, I like this one. at a little bit of an angle. We need a couch. Because that was, that's fine. Um, I can't edit this, so the chase is on the other side. Does this have an art deco pattern on it? Not really. As chair, I thought these did have the Art Deco pattern, but apparently it doesn't. We just need one chair, yes? Yeah. It's that one? No. This one. Coffee table. I like that one right off. We need closet. In fact, we're going to do two of them. Oh, okay. Got it. Didn't realize that. There are symbols. To specify what kind of collection it's in. That's in the Santana. This is this is the Art Deco. Okay. Give me this. Uh, one oh six. Gonna go in the boys' room. This is also gonna go in the boys' room. 
because I don't want to keep wasting money because we're... Money's a little on the tight side. That's not bad. And then let's get the chair over here as well. One six. I'm going to have to upgrade room 101. Is that? Oh, I can't even tell. I don't even know what color I just used on that couch. You know what? I take that back. We're going to go back to the Art Deco pattern and... Yeah, you matched the drape. And I... Change the color. We're just going to go whole hog on this pattern in here. Okay, that takes care of the Art Deco furniture. Just need some shelves. And we need to figure out what we're doing in this front room. I squeeze you in here. Thank you. In fact, I kind of like doing one of those in there as well. Uh, we need some shelves. And then probably some decorations. We're putting a TV over there. We'll do one there and can I rotate? I cannot rotate that. Shelving. We'll do some pictures in there. Tackle the bathroom real quick. I think kind of a cloth foot would be nice in the corner, and then we'll do a shower in the opposite corner. Thinking just something basic like that.
toilet over here. As for sinks, I think we're just going to do like a hanging sink. Because there's not really any other shelving or anything. See, that would be nice. More bathroom cabinets. I, I don't know. We do have two beds in here. We should probably do a couple sinks. I think we're going to do the same kind of sinks we've done in the past. One and two. I assume that's setting correctly. Hand towel areas. With a paper roll. Towels over there, towels over here. And then we just kind of need some of the bathroom accessories. And I do want a mirror in here. Um, I think a single barrel work. There. So that's basically the place I'm going to spend a little bit of time and do some uh, last decorating throughout. And I'll be right back with the finished product. Okay. I think I've got the room finished up for Joe. We walk in. We've got a couple pictures in here. Change the color just to add a little bit of pink into the area as you're passing through. Some art. Can I? Yeah. And we've got a nice uh, little table there at the front. We go into the, uh, let's go straight, added a carpet there, and, hi cat, a little bit of art on the wall, some plants to kind of pull the place together, got a TV opposite that, got the pink grapefruit on the wall, kind of go with the, the room, added some plant and some vases. And then going into the bathroom, a little bit of uh, decoration in here, have the pink curtain up as well. So I think Uncle Joe's room is done. Um, we'll go ahead and uh, finish the renovation on that. And Uncle Joe's room's come a long way. I didn't get all the pink, but I did get the art deco. Doing 100 bucks a day. That's Fine, we'll go ahead and uh, close that one up. Ooh, $1,000 style reward. So this is going to be bride and groom. Take out that. Anything else I missed? Sell the oil painting. Anything else? So this is just a very small space. Let's see if we can knock this out real, fairly quick. So floors, ceramic tiles, no, I think we're going to go a little bit more basic. Plants and candles, so I think this is going to be 
fairly basic, not too over the top. We're going to stick with carpet. We're looking at something more elegant, right? Like that. Too light. Too dark. I like the gray. I think we're just gonna do carpet throughout. Uh the door area. I need to do the ceramic on here. There we go. So that takes care of that. Um, can I? No. I need the crowbar for that. There. Crowbar, the newspaper. Candles and plants. I'm feeling very black and white here, if we're being fully honest. Um,. to find me a decent uh, black and white. That's not bad. As for the rest of the space, bed's going over here. I don't know why I'm always inclined to do some kind of pattern above the bed. We're going to do it on this wall. So we want plants, so maybe we do foresty? Let's do ferns. If you spent any time on my channel, you know I love me some ferns. Kind of thinking a light green throughout. So much for going like light black and white honeydew. Be a little bit dark. Oh, that's what I want. Up ceiling. I don't think I wanted to do the ceiling in that same color. May need to change the color of the carpet. And by may need to, I think it's going to. Yeah, I feel the broom does a larger area in the vacuum. Just doesn't require the effort. Floors, carpet. Still like that pattern, but I think I want something in the green tone. Not quite that. I want that, but in green, like a dark forest green.
Okay, land down new carpet. Getting rid of the map. So you've got a dark green carpet, light green walls, nice foresty picture. Uh, need ceiling paint. Painting's just a white. I keep going back to the silk gray. It's very flat. Boop. There we go. Oh, I missed carpet. And there. I also missed wall. Okay. That's the same color, yeah. We need furniture. Let's add some furniture real quick. Bed. Lovely large bed in here. Gonna keep it just a generic. Given the wall. I guess that's not too bad. Yeah. Use some just small cap. those are small. Still need a couch and table? Really? I feel like there's not a lot of space in here. Table, couch and chair over here, I guess? Something in the light greenish color. Having it match the bed would be great. There we go. Got our armchair as well. at a little bit of an angle. Here we go. Coffee. I'm not going to be able to find the same kind of wood grain, am I? Pretty sure that answer is going to be no. Ah, close. Oh. 
small room, I need a small table. Do we not have anything small? Answer is pretty close to no. I'm going to put it at a little bit of an angle. There we go. So, kind of a small little table over in front of the window. Got our bed. We need another cabinet. Ooh, there are some really nice wood shades in here. All right, we've got our closet in. We've got everything but the shelves. Uh, we'll do a shelf there, and I guess a shelf over here. And apparently I missed the ceiling. So we've got our lovely bed. Can't change the wood cut. Because I can't find anything that'll match that wood shade. So I think we're just gonna have to kind of go with that. Uh, let's handle the bathroom, tub, shower. Maybe? Just need a tub, actually. I think we're going to go with you. You look large enough for two people. A couple newlyweds. Toilet. You actually fit the same color scheme. We're going to move the toilet kind of further over here. We'll do the uh, cabinet on that side. Do a cabinet. Want something dark. Kind of match the black and whiteness of the bathroom. I don't actually have any idea where I'm kind of going with this design, but we will see. We will do a single sink in the middle. Oh, 
I can't change the wood. I really don't like that sink sitting like that. We will go with it. Uh, need some towels. Bathroom accessories. So at this point, I'm going to go ahead and accessorize everything, and I will see you in a second. Okay, so we got the plants added, we've got the pictures in place, we've got a couple plants in here, which is good. Um, thinking about this tile, quite frankly. I think I'm going to change the tile in the bath. Because I want something to tie more in with the green and the walls outside. That just looks dirty. <laughs> And maybe that's just what this tile is. I want something clean. No. Too dark. Yes. That's It matches more with the rest of the room. So we've got the nice bathroom in here. We've got some complimentary toothbrushes and toothpaste, hairspray. All that's done. Close that door off. A couple plants in here. Kind of tying in with the, uh, the wallpaper. And we've got our frog hanging out. We need some candles. So let's come in and let's get some decorations going, get some candles. Start with these here. Apparently we need lots of candles. Okay. Candles, candles, candles. A bookcase would be nice. Apparently we need a lot of candles. Holy cow. You count as a candle. Add a couple of candles over there. Um, It would be nice if I could get those actually in there. 
But I don't think that's something I can do. But I do want something in these. I'm leaning towards a small plant. How about a little Buddha? I think a Buddha will work well. And I think we got ourselves a finished room. So hopefully it's enough candles. But yeah, like the way these turned out, let's go ahead and finish the renovations. See, I wish I could salvage some of the uh, stuff that we've got. Yeah, not too bad. 200 bucks a day, I can get behind that. The last room we've got is the boys' room down here. And we've already got some furniture in here. Need some neon decorations, but I think that's going to have to wait until next time. Thank you all for watching. I appreciate you guys for being here, and I look forward to seeing you guys again in Hotel Renovator. And as always, I hope you guys have yourselves a spectacular day. Oh, yeah.